you going? Sorry, I'm so clumsy. And I should look at my phone less. My name's Cindy. And I'm Dylan. Where are you going, Dylan? To my dad's store. He's a businessman. I know there's a store nearby, but it's so poor. Um, I wouldn't have said so. Uh, uh, Sorry, come in. <laughs> you're so sweet. <sighs> oh, wait, I forgot. Oh, no. Dad will kill me. Imagine, I decide to save money today. And there's even cardboard carts in the store. Mm-hmm, I know. I think it's going to rain now. There are holes in our roof. Oh, it's gone. Great, now I'm all wet. And your stupid car is falling apart. No problem. I'll check everything here. No need, I'd rather go to a normal store. Oh, how cringy. Don't pay attention to that lowly store. <laughs> now that's service. Why are the clients so high strung? Thanks to the proximity to your lowly store, I won't even know what to do with all my money soon. <laughs> Congratulations. Though, You'd better get out of here. Huh. You're the one who should get out. This is my store, and I have proof. Get out. Here. <laughs> the only thing that that proves is that you're a loser. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Dylan. Bring me the store documents right away. Ah! Ah! Look where you're going. Sorry, I'm so clumsy. My name's Cindy. And I'm Dylan. <laughs> oh, sorry. Uh, Come in. <laughs> you're so sweet. Oh, wait. I forgot. Oh, no. Dad will kill me. Well, finally. Where did you get stuck? Well, I met... Let's go. I need to show this rich lady that my store is always going to be here. Why did you show up here? You still don't have any money to shop in our store. <laughs> here. I'm showing you that I also have documents for my store. <laughs> but this is just dirty paper. Dirty? Dylan! Well, I accidentally stepped on it and... Mom, we also started a small kiosk. That's right, darling. What a store. What documents. Huh. Now get out of here. You're making my store reek of poverty. My store will become even more successful than hers. She's so beautiful. Hey, start working. What are you staring at? That Dylan is pretty cute. Don't even look at that poor guy. Got it? But mom... You don't have enough work? I'll give you more. Dylan, wake up. Time to work. Dad, stop. I'm sleeping. I said wake up. The goods won't sell themselves. You should have sold this store a long time ago. It just brings losses. That's no surprise with workers like this. C. 
Cindy. I need, I need to get to the store. I love working. Oh, what should I wear? Huh? Hmm. Huh? Oh, what's this? <laughs> Dad, why are you just standing there? We need to go to work! What's gotten into you? Hey, why did you put that on? It's for sale! Dad, I need it! Stop! Put the sweatshirt back, Dylan! Oh, which juice should I take? This one or this one? I have a better idea for you! Cindy! We need fresh squeezed juice! Gosh, it's so heavy. What's Ugh. that? It's a special service. Fresh juice for our favorite customers. Cool! I'll always come into your shop in the future. <gasps> you see how to attract customers? Learn from this. No, that's overkill. We should think about how to attract customers. <clears throat> Could you check me out first? You can be more polite, girl. Dylan, don't you want to help me? This tree is so heavy. Of course, I'll just leave the customer. <laughs> hey! Dylan, what are you doing? Me? What's that? Ugh, this isn't a store, it's some kind of a dump! And your purchases? Dylan, what are you thinking about? You'll drive us bankrupt! Dad, I have important things to do. What could be more important? Dylan! We'll be out of work! Maybe I just imagined that Dylan liked me. Otherwise, he would have asked me on a date a long time ago. Come on, Dylan. Do it, or else you'll just dream about Sydney. Oh, finally. Oh, no. Sydney. Ah! Dylan, what are you doing here? Saving you. Can't you see? <laughs> and where did the skateboard come from? Um, well, it's. Uh. <gasps> There's a note. Cindy, I want to ask you on a date. Dylan. Well, that's my broken skateboard. So will you go on a date with me? <laughs> well, considering that you just saved me, <laughs> of course I will. <laughs> cool. But you probably won't like the dinner since I don't have any money. No problem. We can go Dutch. But uh, I'll definitely treat you to the best ice cream sometime. <sighs> I'll see you tonight at the cafe. The most important thing is that mom doesn't find out. Well, where's Dylan? I have to do everything myself. Why did you drag me into this horrible store? There's no service here. There's not even a cashier. It's a decent shop, but the prices are lower. Yes! Ah! We have the best prices in town. Why scare us like that? What do you want to buy? We haven't decided if we want to buy something here or not. Oh! Ah! These cereals taste better. You again? Mia, let's get out of here and go to a normal shop. Just wait. Here I am. Ah! But who drinks such cheap milk? Take this instead. That's it! I'm done! <sighs> Mia, let's go to a normal shop! Uh, hey, where are you going? Well, yeah, I don't have fresh squeezed fruit juice, but I have good service too! We should have come here from the start, not to that awful shop. You made the right choice. We have the best store in town. And the highest prices. You shouldn't go into that dump. 
<gasps> Did she just call my store a dump? Hey, that was my last food! Oh, but you can help me. Mice in the best store in town? I'm freaking out! Ah! Wait, where are you going? That'll teach you to insult my beloved shop. How did this filth get into my shop? Why didn't I guess at once? Hello, Cindy. You're already here? Hello, Dylan. I came early and already ordered. What will you have? Well, I, um, brought my own food. <laughs> Bread crust? Are you serious? Um, I'm on a diet. I only eat dry bread. I thought the reason might be that you don't have any money. Yes, I don't have money for a meeting like that. Sorry, I probably was wrong to think we were a match. Hey, why talk like this? I didn't mean that. Money doesn't mean anything to me. Really? Guys, do you think me and Cindy are a good couple? Tell me in the comments. Of course. The important thing is that I really like you. <coughs> Try this. It's delicious. Wow, I wondered where Dylan was. Now what is he doing with that rich woman's daughter? Mwah. Thank you for a nice evening. No, thank you for spending time with me. Shall we? Yes. <laughs> My son is dating a rich girl? He's a good lad. And this will benefit me. Hmm, what a good cafe. I should come here more often. One, two, three, and done. Mm, no, this price is too low. That's much better. <laughs> Muscles in your shop? I can't believe it. Did you rob someone? <laughs> no. Dylan and Cindy didn't finish them on their date. And I thought I shouldn't let them go to waste. <laughs> <laughs> Collecting leftovers? <laughs> Wait, on what day? Didn't you know? Our children are going out. That's impossible! My Cindy can't go out with a poor guy. Ah! Hey, be careful swinging with your tantrums! You destroyed my whole window display! Mom, what happened? Why are you yelling? Are you really asking? I'll show you! What's going on? Kitty found out that Cindy is going out with you. And I guess she's furious? Who would have guessed? You will not date the son of that poor man, or else. Or else what? Or I won't let you have any money. And you can go begging with him. Hey, my son doesn't beg. Well, I always knew that you were obsessed with money. Mom, but I never thought you didn't care about my happiness. <laughs> Cindy, wait! Let them date. Why do you care about it? My daughter will never, listen, not ever, go out with your son. Get out of my shop! What a weirdo. Uh, is anyone at this register? I wanted to buy this. You're poor. We don't need customers like you. What? You heard me. Get out of here. <sighs> uh, uh, why 
Why does my life depend on these little papers? <laughs> Cindy, we need to talk. Dylan, I'm sorry about my mom. She doesn't know what she's saying. Your mother is right. We aren't a match for each other. You shouldn't suffer because of me if your allowance is cut off. What? What the heck are you saying? Rich people should date rich people. And poor people like me are doomed to loneliness. No, that's not true. Listen to your mom. Cindy, it'll be better for you. No, Dylan, don't leave me. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Money just leads to unhappiness. <laughs> How could Dylan treat me like this? You're lucky that you chose our shop. Our goods are the very best quality. I thought we really liked each other. Cindy, we have a customer. Forget <gasps> about that beggar Dylan now and for good. Do you understand me? I understand, Mom. I'm glad to see you in our store. Congratulations! You're the 1,000th shopper in our shop! And this is your prize, which you can spend on future purchases! Amazing! This I understand! I always told you that you went to the wrong store, bestie! <laughs> you don't have a sale on? Of course we do! <laughs> Dylan, why are you sitting? Scan the things. Right away. Congratulations. You're our thousandth customer. <gasps> Yay! <laughs> Dad, what are you doing? Play along. This is your prize. Is that all? <laughs> the shop and the prizes match. I'm so fed up with you. That's it. I'm fed up. I'm not going to work in this shop anymore. <sighs> I wish this store never existed ever. <coughs> Son, I think I'm sick. <laughs> Will you work instead of me? I told you, I won't set foot in your supermarket ever again! <coughs> oh, I think I'm getting worse. Dad, what's wrong? Are you sick? <laughs> I'm really sick. And if my store closes, I'll never get better. <laughs> fine, fine. I'll go to work. But this is the last time, and only because you're sick. I think I'm a wonderful actor. Maybe I chose the wrong career. <laughs> if I don't see Cindy, I can probably forget her. Wow. Dylan really doesn't care about me. Uh. Did no one tell you not to sleep in the workplace? You could be fired. <laughs> What would you like? Hmm. Money. What? Sorry. Open the cash register, I said. Uh, here. Take this. But please don't hurt me. Right away. Stop it. Calm down, calm down, calm down. What? <laughs> you thought you'd stop me with this? Uh, I don't think it worked. Now. Do you know what I do to jokers like this? Leave her alone! Huh? Dylan, save me! Who's the hero? Are you insane? Now the police will deal with this thief. Thank you, Dylan. You saved me. Anyone would have done the same in my place. Can we give our relationship a second chance? Maybe you can work that out when I'm not here. It's a gross sight. Ugh. 
You'll be looking at jail bars soon. Let's go, Cindy. Hey, what about me? Dylan, let's never say goodbye again. What about your mom? She'll take all your money away. I don't care about money. The important thing is that we're together. Shall we order something? I think you forgot that I'm poor. But I have an idea! What is it? Do you see that? It's a real elephant! How did it get in here? An elephant? Where? I need to see this. It's over there! Oh, it's leaving. <gasps> this is for you. Did you steal them? Let's just say I borrowed them. When I get money, I'll return everything. You're so cool. <laughs> Cindy, what are you doing with this poor guy again? Mom, his name is Dylan. He saved me from a thief today. Or I'll rephrase, he saved your money. What thief is this? The thief who is robbing our store today. Whether you like it or not, Dylan and I are going to date. Come on, Dylan. He saved my daughter and my store? I guess those poor people aren't so bad. Ugh, what am I saying? There's no elephant. I seriously looked everywhere. What elephant? Hey, did you take the cakes from the counter? Who's going to pay? Me? Are you insane? Ugh. Poverty's rotted your brain. Where's that elephant? Uh, I'm so glad that Dylan and I are dating again. Hey, how long do I have to wait? Could you serve me? I'll ring it up for you. Your relationship with this Dylan won't lead to anything good. Mom, this conversation is closed. We'll be together forever. Cindy, come back. Who's going to work? You look bored. There's no customers. But I'm not bored. I'm watching you working. <laughs> well, son, how many people came in today? How much did we earn? Nothing. By the way, I wanted to tell you that Cindy and I are... <laughs> Good day. Who's in charge here? Me. I own this supermarket. Perfect. I represent the bank. And it's time to pay the bill for the manager. 3,000 bucks? But we don't have money like that. That means the bank will repossess your shop. You have two days. I feel sick. <laughs> Not this. Or this. Or this. Or this. Oh no. My shop! <laughs> I heard your stupid shop will disappear soon. Finally, I've been waiting for this. Mom? Stop it, Miss Kitty. That's not funny. Just you wait. I'll pay the bills. And then my shop will be better than yours. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> What am I going to do now? <laughs> Where did I put my savings? I don't remember at all! Dad, have you lost something? Remember the money I was saving? Where is it? You mean this money? Twenty dollars! Is that all? <laughs> I'll lose my store! <laughs> Dad, don't get upset. I'll definitely think of something. We're together. We can handle it. Not one customer all day. Why is the world so unfair to me? Hmm, right. Don't think I got everything. Oh! <gasps> 
no such thing as too much shopping. Hello, Dad. <clears throat> Come into our shop. We have amazing discounts today. Dylan, are you crazy? What discounts? You're ruining us in advance. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. Discounts? Oh, I love discounts. Oh, so what kind of sales do you have? Um. Well, <gasps> for example, a milk. We're selling today at half price. Oh, cool. Very fresh milk. <laughs> you won't regret it. Why are you yelling like that? Oh, it broke. Now you owe us for the milk and for the cleaning. That's a lie. I'm calling the cops. The cops aren't necessary. Here's a present from our shop. Mm. Good plan, son. They won't make any money like that. Ugh. You know these products are past their expiration date. Well, I checked. And everything's fine with the dates. Believe me, I should know. But in that shop, everything's fresh. And the cost is much lower. Well, all right. What are you doing? I can't believe it. What does it look like? I'm helping Dylan and his father save their store. Oh my goodness. Come back right now! If you want to make money, you have to take it for everything. Cindy, you're a genius! Do you need a bag? No, thank you. I have my own. Oh, goodness. Ugh. Oh! Uh. <gasps> you have a bad bag. Uh, take this instead. It doesn't have holes. Well, all right. Thank you. Come back again. But this isn't enough. We can't save the shop. Thank you for helping, Cindy. Uh, I'll think of something else. This isn't the end. Uh, what do I do now? <laughs> what is it, Cindy? You couldn't save that beggar shop? How tragic. Yes, Mom. We didn't manage to earn enough money. Are you happy? You're still asking? Yes, I'm just <laughs> happy. <laughs> You're so heartless. Just bathing in money instead of helping people. I never thought you would be like that. <laughs> I've never helped a poor person? We need to come up with something. Think, Cindy, think. It's all over. The bank will repossess my store today. <laughs> Dad, we'll open a new supermarket. Come on. Uh, it's time to pay. Do you have the money? Please, give us a little more time. We'll get it. You have had enough time. The store doesn't have money. I'll buy this store. <gasps> wow, I'll be glad to do business with you. Uh. I'll open a nail salon. And a barber shop. I can't believe it. How will I survive this? 
<laughs> Thank you for helping, Cindy. We did everything we could. You are so heartless, Mom. There's nothing human about you. <laughs> Don't start, Cindy. Dylan saved me from a thief. And this is how you thank him? I don't want to see you anymore. Ever. Does my daughter really think I'm heartless? Cindy, wait! Oh, please forgive my mom. I didn't think she would do something like this. <laughs> What's done is done. <laughs> Take your documents. I've changed my mind. <gasps> mom! I knew you had a kind heart. Thank you. <laughs> what got into her? What was that? Are you the same person? I just decided to thank your son in this way. He really did save my daughter. I never thought I'd say this, but you're really cool. Let's not go through these sloppy parts. They don't look bad together. <laughs> I think so too. My store! I'm so glad they didn't take it! Mom, maybe Mr. Harry deserves your attention. He's a good guy. Me? No. What are you saying? Well, son, our supermarket has been saved. And I think I've earned a vacation. I'm leaving you in charge. Where will you get money for a vacation? I don't need money to relax. You're funny, Dad. I'll open up. I won't distract you from your vacation. Ah, oh, so nice. Look who's here. Hello. Kitty, what are you doing here? What's going on here? Dad's on vacation. Maybe we could go on a real vacation? You've worked so much recently. Uh, what? But I don't have any money, and you hate poor people. Yesterday, I understood that happiness isn't about money. So, shall we? I'll pay for you. Maybe something will work out between us. Why aren't you saying anything? Come on, say yes. Uh, fine. Let's go. I'm ready. Don't forget to put on pants. <laughs> Cindy, thanks to you, our poor shop has become a real supermarket. We did it together. <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine how shocked my mom and dad will be. Oh, oh, is this my store? What happened here? Dylan and I did some work while you were away. Where's mom? Um... I don't know what to tell you. What's this? What happened to this beggary shop? Yeah, it's unrecognizable. Dad, can you explain what happened? Kitty left me for the banker. Right, Kitty? What? what? Yes, now Nate and I are going out because he's rich and powerful. Unlike me. What about what you said about happiness not being about money? Yeah, I said that without thinking. Let's go, Cindy. We're going to move to a different city <gasps> together. What? No, I'm not going anywhere. Dylan! <laughs> yeah, Cindy isn't going anywhere. No one asked you. We have a plane in two hours. Let's go. We need to pack our bags. By the way, I'm giving you my shop, Harry. No, Dylan! Do something! <laughs> no! No! Give Cindy back! I can't live without her! Hooray! Now I have two whole stores! Now I'll have gold bars, like in my dreams! Sorry, I'll try again. Let's do it again. Come on. You look bored. Mm, I'm not 
bored. <laughs> I'm not bored. Why does she think Are I'm bored? Are you bored, son? There is no elephant. I looked everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Miss, can't you be a bit more polite? Just wait. I'll pay the whole bill and then... <laughs> Can you please not? <laughs> Look who's here! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Blue bar. <laughs> ah, it hurts. What is it? <laughs> are you nuts? <laughs> it's a pen. <laughs> Why are you scaring me? I'm showing you what's going to happen to you in the future. Your clients will always yell like that. <laughs> oh, yeah? You know what? <gasps> Ah, what will they do with this nonsense on my forehead? Did someone knock? Someone's knocking in your head. <sighs> oh, there's no one here. Just a box. Hmm. Okay, what's in there? It looks like your brain. <laughs> there are some pieces. Maybe I'll have to put something together? We'll be putting together money for your hospital bills <sighs> if you don't take this tattoo off my face. Okay, I'm opening it. Let's see the last detail. Okay. <gasps> it's a tattoo machine! Holy moly! Why are you yelling? I have a tattoo machine now! Yeah! I gotta tell my dad! Guys, do you like real tattoos or stick on? Write in the comments. What's with this kettle? Dad, you'll never believe what happened. Answer me this. What happened to the kettle? Why is it all covered in stickers? Dad, you don't understand anything. It's a trend. What? Better look what I've got. Tattoo machine. What is this thing? Where did you get it? I don't know. I, I found it by the door by accident. Dad, give me money for my business. <laughs> Wait a sec. What's that on your hand? Must be dirt. What? Did you get a tattoo? No, it's a stick-on tat on my hand. But soon I'll learn how to use a tattoo machine and I'll get a real one. I forbid you to do this. This is my life and I will decide what to do and how to look. Oh, yeah? Then I won't give you any money. Well, fine. I'm moving to a school dorm. You can't even clean up your room. You won't survive in a dorm. Everyone will support me there. Unlike you. Girls, you ready to meet our friends? Well, yeah. Finally, our game will be complete. Now we'll be able to prank the boys together. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm strong. I can carry these suitcases. Oh. oh. Is she going on a trip around the world? <laughs> or just decided to move your house here? <laughs> oh. Hey, girls. Are you waiting for me? Of course. Great. Then help me bring all this stuff into my room. Whoa. What happened? I left home. My dad didn't give me money for my tattoo studio. But it's okay. I'll just ink you. No, no please, please don't. don't. Maybe some other time. Ah! Girls, come on. We got to do an initiation for Nikki. Well, do you think we could distract her? I hope so, because she doesn't see anything except her tattoos. Turn on the speaker. Nikki, come out. It's us. <laughs> Who's breaking into our room? What's going on? Am I the only one seeing this? Or am I hallucinating? Nah. I see this too. You again? Sick of you. Not a moment of peace. What? We can care less about you. Big deal. We just mixed up the rooms. We weren't going to break in. Yeah, you're clearly up to no good. Let's go, girls. They're driving me nuts. <sighs> uh. Girls, I'm so happy I moved into our dorm. We're really happy, too. You remember what are the rules of this picnic? 
We had to bring different foods for a certain color. Let's start then. First color is pink. Wow, girls, my color is yellow. And my color is green. Look, we've got lots of goodies for our picnic. My color is black. I hope you didn't bring your tattoo machine. FYI, it's not edible. <laughs> oh man, I really want to ink you. This is my dream. Hey, get out of here. This is our spot, so beat it. We want to play football. So get lost. Why did you do that? My machine was in there. You are the biggest fools. What machine is she talking about? Who cares? Two of them gone, good enough. Now let's deal with them. We're sick of you. <laughs> it was much easier than I thought. Let's play some ball. Where's my bag? My tattoo machine was in there. Well, did you find it? No, it's my first day at the dorm and I already lost my dream. Don't worry, you'll buy yourself a new tattoo machine. Where will I get the money? Drake is such a jerk. Why am I always into such guys? What did you say? Uh, no, nothing. I didn't say anything. Look, isn't that part of your bag? <gasps> it is! Zara, it is! Oh, here's another box. Whoa, what's in the box? <gasps> it's ink! <laughs> Yay! Now I have all I need! Ooh, now we gotta hide from you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, you keep practicing and you can make us tats in a couple years, but this is not for sure. Oh, Zara! <laughs> Zara, I'm ready to ink you. Are you kidding? Well, I have to practice on someone. How will I open a tattoo studio? Wake up. What studio? <sighs> You gotta practice a lot to become a tattoo artist. <gasps> I know! Okay, what do you think? Am I a pro already? It's nothing to do with the glasses. You're just all thumbs. If you don't want to, I won't force you. I'll just try something on myself. You are obsessed with this. Yep. Well, there. The second tattoo is done. Gotta tell you, it looks pretty good. Really? Should I ink you next then? No, 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 no. Thanks. I'm good for now. If only I had lots of money, I'd open a tattoo studio. <gasps> <gasps> Nikki, what is this? My tattoo started glowing and then the money fell on us. Is this real magic? I don't know, but I'm scared. Something's clearly going on in this room. Let's get out of here before something else happens. Barbie, do you have an idea what just happened? Judging by Nikki's face, a huge dog was chasing you. Money just rained down on us from the sky. <laughs> <laughs> Nikki, then let them follow me too if it's so simple. I did a tattoo, then I wished I had money, and they appeared. Wow, your magic tattoo machine must be granting wishes. <laughs> Nikki, ink me anywhere you want. Let's do it right now. What wish should I make? It's not for real. Your wish won't come true. Let her concentrate. If I say that I want a suitcase full of money, it will appear just because of Zara's tattoo? Hey, it was my wish. Why did you say that? What? It really works? Oh my gosh, a suitcase! Girls, I love it so much. I have money now. This is my suitcase. I got the tattoo. And I made the wish. Barbie, you didn't even want to believe it. I will keep this money. What, what is, is that? that? My tattoo machine, my money. Although, I will give this money to the person who will help me build my tattoo studio. No, I'm out. I'll help you. I could use some cash. Whoa! We did great, Zara. 
Now I have my own studio. Let's send out an ad and the clients will come. You, I'm so tired. You'll pay me, right? Should we repaint the walls? You kidding? I can't feel my hands or legs. Of course, no kidding. Don't you get my jokes anymore? Yeah, only a nut job would laugh at your jokes. Yeah, that's why you're my audience. <laughs> Stop it, I wanna get another tattoo. Are you sure? Of course, if they grant wishes, I'm ready to ink my whole body. <sighs> Look, it says magic ink, but that's the only one. So only this ink grants wishes? Come on, do it then. I want... a chill! <laughs> Zara, my hand twitched because of you. Do you want a crooked tattoo? Sorry. Done. Make a wish. I want to have cool makeup. Ooh. Well, do I have cool makeup? Well, how should I tell you? <gasps> what a nightmare! Nikki, what have you done to me? How is it my fault? You sneezed and I twitched because of you. Now I will have to wash off this trash. Anyway, if you want to charm girls, you gotta be a good kisser. How do I do that? You'll see. What? Learn to kiss on tomatoes. Uh, are you sure it will help? <laughs> That's how I learned. Uh, I mean, not me, but other people. Come on, do it. Mmm, yummy. No biting, you're practicing. What? Are you learning how to kiss on tomatoes? <laughs> no, 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 you got it all wrong. <laughs> yeah, you're nuts. That's exactly what you're doing. <laughs> we just decided to make a salad from tomatoes. Yeah, sure you did. Try telling it to someone else. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Drake. I made a fool of myself. Cindy, I decided to get a tattoo. For real? You never liked it. When you get a tattoo and make a wish, it comes true. This is nonsense. I didn't believe it myself, but I saw it with my own eyes. Zara's wish came true. How can I check it? Go get a tattoo. Hey, Drake, where are you? Tattoos can wait. Now I gotta take care of these jerks. <sighs> if this Cindy says something to anyone, forget about it. She's a dummy. Already forgot everything. Whoa! Why aren't they scared? Ah! Ah! Don't scare us with your faces. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. We'll scare you better next time. Well, how's your studio going? There are no clients at all. Maybe I should get another tattoo. I want to make a wish. You're kidding me, right? It's true. The tattoo machine grants wishes. Well, Nikki, maybe it's because of the magic ink. Okay, if the wish doesn't come true, you'll owe me one. Our tattoo studio respects its customers. Have a seat. We'll see. Cindy, now you can make a wish. Wow, lying right to my face. I can't believe it. This again? Just make a wish. <sighs> you made me real mad. I want you to have a mustache. Oh, come on, please don't. Ooh, something went wrong. Ah, mustache! I have a mustache! You believe it now, Cindy? Jeez, I'm sorry. I didn't think it was true. You gotta make a normal wish, not this. Where are my normal clients? Ugh. Hmm, there has to be a magical tattoo studio around here somewhere. Uh, I don't see it. Hey, stop! Got money? Can you tell me where's the tattoo studio? What tattoo studio? You got problems not only with your vision, but with your brains too? It's a school dorm. And what are you doing here? I'm telling you, I saw an ad. So I came here to make my wish come true. My wish is to destroy a four-eyed troll like you. 
Um, I'm always ready for this. <laughs> what? <laughs> nice try. <laughs> How many of those you got? Will you try again? <laughs> Zach, let's get out of here. I'm tired of breaking his glasses. I can't believe this nerd. I wonder what tattoo studio he was talking about. Hi, everyone. My friend opened her magic tattoo studio. Zara, can you do something useful? Here she is, by the way. Stop it. I'm promoting us. Unbelievable. Is this a real tattoo studio? Why do you need it? Go to the library. Nah, I came here to get the coolest tattoo. You? For real? <laughs> well, okay. Have a seat. <laughs> here. You can choose from here. Oh, no. These are tattoos for nerds. And I'm cool. Well, okay, you can make a wish. I want all the girls to be obsessed with me, and I want to be the most popular guy at our school. Uh, <laughs> awesome, I have a real tat. Oh, wow, you're really psyched. I hope he'll leave us some tips. It's gonna be 20 bucks. Hey, but my wish didn't come true yet. Hey. What's this? Nerd, did you pee your pants? <laughs> oh man, we gotta go live with us. <laughs> what am I gonna do? How will I go home? Nikki, look how many <gasps> new followers we have. <laughs> Nerd, you became popular. Your wish came true. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid tattoos. I knew they didn't grant wishes. <laughs> Good thing my pants dried quickly. Wow, who is this handsome guy? I already spent $20, but my wish didn't come true. My new crush. What was that? Hello. Um, why are you following me? You're so handsome. Seriously? You want to go to the movies or on a date? Oh, wow. Looks like my wish is coming true. You're so cool. I always wanted a boyfriend like that. Oh, yeah. Ah, why are you doing this? Well, you wanted a boyfriend like that. Get away from me, nerd. I'm leaving. Something went wrong with my wish. I'll never have a girlfriend. Girls, I decided to get another tattoo. Yeah? Why all of a sudden? Well, I spent my last wish on Barbie. Ah, uh, you mean the mustache? <laughs> I want to make another wish. Give me your hand. You got the marksman and... Do you know a wish to make? This will be the thing I've been dreaming of my whole life. Yeah, what is it? I want to lose at least two pounds. <laughs> <laughs> Cindy. Looks like she lost two pounds. Why are you laughing? What is it? <laughs> you have no hair. <laughs> Your stupid tattoos. What will I do now? Cindy, now get another tattoo and wish for your hair to grow back. <laughs> Thanks for the support. I told you to be more specific. <laughs> Ah, oh, Drake, I'm so bored. I haven't seen those girls in a while. Hmm, let's finish the game and go bully them. And we'll start with Barbie. Ouch, are you nuts? It was an accident. <laughs> we didn't see you. Don't lie. <laughs> I know all you want to do is bully us. Interesting. And where are you going? Why do you care? We're just curious. <laughs> I'm going to finally get a tattoo. You too? We saw a nerd who was looking for a tattoo studio. You don't know? Our girls opened the magic tattoo studio. <laughs> Why didn't anyone tell us? And what does it mean, magic tattoos? After you get inked, your wish comes true. So I'm gonna do it. 
We want to do it too. Let's go there. Yeah, right. Did you hear? Magic tattoos. And without us? Uh, let's go there. Well, didn't expect us. Drake, they're not here yet. Great. Just look at their studio. Unbelievable. Where did they get the money for all this? In this magic machine. The real one? Well, it must be since they opened the studio. If tattoos grant wishes, let's take it all. Let's do it. Let those dummies look for it. Well, we have new clients. Why are you asking me? Well, you went live and promoted my tattoo studio. This doesn't mean that everyone will come running here. Zara, give me back the tattoo machine. I didn't take anything. It's not funny. I can't find it. Machine and ink were right here on the table. How could I take it if we were together? Oh no, it was stolen. My dream was stolen. Maybe you just have a bad memory and you don't remember where you put it. All that's left is magic ink. I know it. Someone stole it. Then let's look for it. <laughs> so what tattoo do you want? Something awesome. I want this tattoo to reflect my personality. Tattoo won't help you. <laughs> Don't be smart. We gotta check if it grants wishes. Come on, ink me. But if it hurts, don't yell in my ear. Okay, now I'll make a wish. Think faster. I want a cool car. It's not working. I don't get it. Where's the car? We probably didn't do enough. Let's add a tattoo. Yeah? Okay, let's do another one. Done. Try to make a wish again. I want a luxury villa on the islands. Mm. Yeah, seems that it doesn't work. It can't be. If everyone was going to this studio, then wishes are coming true. Ink another one. Uh, yeah, looks like we went too far. I'll teach these girls a lesson. Barbie must have tricked us on purpose. Nikki, <laughs> don't be upset. Oh, it's just a tattoo machine. It was my dream. And someone stole it. <laughs> Your machine. You want to tell us something? This thing doesn't work. Don't you dare throw it. Uh, we got Drake a bunch of tattoos and wishes didn't come true. Like Barbie said. Because the ink grants wishes. So I inked my hand for nothing? Why did you steal my tattoo machine? You could just come and ask us for tattoos. They are just so dumb. They don't even know how to ask people. How could I like you, Drake? You disappointed me. You liked him? Nikki, you said you don't have a crush. Yeah, well, it happened. So you hid it from us? Enough. Guys, you did an awful thing. Girls, I'm sorry I didn't tell you. For real. We're always fighting, keeping secrets from each other. Can we make up? And you'll show us how these tattoos grant wishes in a proper way. All right, now Nikki, as a pro tattoo artist, will ink all of us. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we did it. <laughs> ah, it was true after all. Huh, there's no empty space left on our hands. But now we're rich. Well, let's go on a trip to the Maldives. Yeah! 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 Nikki, can I talk to you? Okay. Girls, I'll be right back. <laughs> Don't kiss too much. <laughs> <laughs> Nikki, I'm sorry for what I did to you. I shouldn't have stolen your tattoo machine. Yeah, true. I was really worried. Um, is it true that you like me? Well, how should I tell you? Tell me the truth. At first, I really did. But after that, I don't know anymore. How can it be? So I tattooed your name on my face for nothing? Are you for real? 
You'll have it forever! Well, I thought we'd start dating. Turns out you don't like me anymore. No, I like you again! Really? Yeah! Then I'll go and wash your name off my face. Can't have it forever, right? So it's not real? Oh, you! Can't catch me! Stop, you liar! Ha ha ha! Drake, Nikki, our lovebirds. We have a plane to catch. Wait a minute, I'll catch Drake and we'll go. Like Lil Cat. pay for what you did! Oh! Hey, what are you doing? We'll call the police! Ah! ah we are being held hostage! Call whoever you want. Nobody will help you. <gasps> mom! Mom! Your mom doesn't decide anything. I'm the head of the family. Understood? Why are you yelling so much this morning? Oh, kids, what's going on here? Mom, I'm here! Ah, 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 ah. Martin, tied us up! Mm -hmm. Honey, can you imagine your kids, I mean our kids, are so disobedient? Ah, so you're disciplining them. <laughs> well, of course. I only want what's best for us. Oh, I was right about you. We have to go get ready for the big day! Let's go, let's yeah. go! Come on! Ah! Eva, are you okay? Ugh! Ouch! Yes, almost! What do we do now? Great start of our birthday! We need something to cut the duct tape! <laughs> I always knew that a nail file can be very useful! Why did mom choose us such an awful stepdad and brought this terrible man into our house? It's fine. We'll deal with him. Well, anyway, happy birthday, sis. You too. Guys, how do you think our birthday will be ruined? Let us know in the comments. Let's go. We have to deal with him. Yeah. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. What are you waiting for? Come on, pop the confetti cracker. Yeah, right. If they need it so much, let them do it. Oh, I mean, honey, my arm hurts so much. Oh, I'm so sorry, dear. I will do it myself. <gasps> wow, thanks, Mom. Yay, we're a year older now. Okay, sit down and let's have some cake. Mom, I love cake. Not yet. <laughs> I can't believe it! You're so grown up! Oh. Mom, maybe we could eat already! Oh, here's your birthday cake! Blow out the candles and make a wish! One, One two, two, three! three. <laughs> ha! You snooze, you lose! Hey, Mom! Martin blew out our candles! Are you out of your mind? <gasps> How are you talking to your future dad, huh? This man will never be our dad. Our dad is normal, and stepdad is clearly not. How dare you talk like that, huh? I'll punish both of you right now. That will create some birthday spirit. What? Who do you think you are to threaten us? There! Whoa! Take that! <laughs> oh no, Anthony, enough! Oh, I'm gonna get you! Back off, you're not our dad! Ah! Why are they so naughty? Don't worry, I'll discipline them. Yes, wash up first. <laughs> Anthony, we can't live here with stepdad like that. Yeah, after our parents got divorced, I mean after mom kicked out dad, we don't have a peaceful life. Our birthday started so badly. Nothing can save it now. I don't get it. How can mom not see that he's a terrible person? Mm-hmm. Oh. Hello, Adam? 
Yeah, thanks. Thanks a lot. Okay, I'll tell him. Adam says happy birthday. Tell him thanks and invite him to come over. Okay. Adam, you can come over to celebrate. Well, if our stepfather lets you in. I'm so sick of him. Oh, man. We're getting so many calls today. you so much my dear twins i want to wish you a happy birthday i miss you so much we miss you too dad thanks for the wishes daddy mwah, mwah, mwah. hey move over quickly let daddy sit down what washed up already hey zip it eva anthony who is this huh? who's this four-eyed monster on our screen <laughs> This is our real dad, unlike you. What? Is this wimp your father? Don't insult him. We love him, not you. Oh, hush, little jerk. Hey, what's going on? Who is this? Kids, kids, kids. Enough. Bye-bye, four-eyed monster. Hey, we didn't say goodbye to our dad. I'm your dad. Conversation over. No, this will never happen. Wait and see. Stop ringing the bell. I'm not deaf. Good afternoon. Oh, wow. You're that four-eyed guy from the laptop. How can it be? You were on the screen just a second ago, and now you're here. Uh... I came to see my kids, actually. And I live next door. Forget about your kids, understood? And don't come here again. Never. Dad, you came. Martin, let him go. I was just, just dusting him off. Daddy, we are so glad you came. <laughs> Yay, Daddy. <laughs> Who let this fraudster into the house, huh? Mom, he is our dad, and he will stay with us. No, I won't let him. Me too. Get out of here. But, but, I just wanted to wish my kids happy birthday. They have a new father. No! no! He stays with us. Today is our birthday. And we'll spend it with our dad. Ugh, you're driving me nuts together with your dad. You are done. Boo! This will be the best day ever! Woo! <laughs> I hope you prepared gifts for the kids. Of course, I have been preparing for a long time. You drive me insane. Jeez, be quiet already. Actually, I have the best gift. Nothing! <laughs> what? Kidding, kidding. But actually, no. Okay, then I'll go bring the kids. Okay. Oh, some unknown caller ID. Hello? This is he. Yes. Now we will see who has better gifts. Come, come. Time to open gifts. Well, here you go. This is the best gift. Yeah. Mmm, doll from the Squid Game. And an envelope with cash? I really don't want to say thank you. Wow, what a great present. Unbelievable. Kids, your new dad is so nice. <laughs> yes, yes, that's me. Wait, I was supposed to give this. This box. This is impossible. Be quiet already. Come on, show your lousy gift. Whoa, there's a bag of cereal. Wow, our favorite cereal! Thanks, Dad! What is going on? 
Hmm, couldn't you give the kids a proper gift? What kind of a father are you? Lame, compared to me. Dad, let's go to the movies to celebrate our birthday. Oh, great idea. You can't go to the movies. Got it? You're nobody. We won't listen to you. Yes, you will. We will go to the movies together. I won't let you go alone with him. <laughs> Let's watch comedy, comedy. Or a horror movie. But comedy sounds good too. Great idea, but we have to get tickets. I already took care <gasps> of it. And you know what we're gonna see? Action movie. Oh no, this trip to the movie theater is for us. And we have to choose. <gasps> Why are you saying that? Your new dad tried so hard. What? He didn't even give us money to buy everyone popcorn. We'll have just one bucket. Um, where's our dad? Wait a second. Who cares? Probably on the toilet, as usual. Huh. I hope that the toilet flushed him. <laughs> I'm security, and I'm scary. Fine. Let's wait for Dad inside. The movie's about to start. Give me the tickets. Here you go. Great. You have row 17. Stop right there. Hey, what's your deal? Let me go in. No. You have a suspicious face. What? I don't get it. Are you looking for trouble? Security? Um, no. It's just, uh... Do you know what I do with guards like you? Uh, help! I will not be stopped by some kind of nut job. <laughs> so, Mom went home and told us to buy everything on the list. Dad, give us the money. Uh, what wouldn't you do for your kids? Man, you're rich. Listen, borrow me some dough, dude. Here you go. You can buy whatever you want. Yay! Our dad is the best. Unlike you. Hey, I can give you money, too. It's not a problem at all. Yeah, and what can you buy with your pennies? Listen. You can buy everything in here if you want. Seriously? Then we will return the money to our dad, and we'll pay with yours. Yeah, you grab the cart, and I'll pay. Come on. Good afternoon, how can I help you? Yeah, can I get those chips up there, please? Here are your chips. Uh, nah, I changed my mind. I don't want these. Here, we got all we need. Uh, kids, maybe you shouldn't. Dad, forget it. Let him pay. <laughs> oh, wow, you got all the groceries so quickly? Yeah, give us some money. Oh, money? Um, I won't give you anything. See you later. I told you he was a liar. Excuse me, I just had $10,000 in my cash register. Your gang stole all my money. No, this must be a misunderstanding. Dad, don't explain anything. Let's just leave. It's not our fault and we won't go to jail. Let's leave. Let's leave, yeah. Security, security, thieves are in the store. Security, thieves are in the store. You're a liar. We were almost arrested already. because of you. Hey! Oh, come on in and go wash your hands. Okay, honey. Why didn't you buy groceries? Someone promised to pay for them. And then he just bailed when it was time to pay. Hmm, it was your dad again, wasn't it? No, it's Martin. He lied to us. Where's dad? But let me in. I'm freezing out here. Man, we forgot you on the street. Come in, come in, hurry. Don't 
Don't let him in the house. He's contagious. We all can get sick. Get him out of here. Come on. He's shaking. Mom, he needs to drink some hot tea. Why would I waste tea on this person? I should probably go. I'm not welcome in this house. No, Dad. You promised to be with us on our birthday. And you, Mom, made a lot of mistakes in your life. If you kick out Dad one more time, we'll go with him. Okay, I'll let him stay. I'll make him a bed near the doghouse. Now you'll have some tea and you'll feel much better. I'll make you some. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Now I'll win a lot of money in this game. I'm the winner. <laughs> take that! Take that! Anthony, take that! Take that! Anthony, take that. Take that. Come on, yeah! What are they doing here? Distracting me from playing my game. Enough! I'm tired of it! Ah! Be quiet! Nasty kids! Otherwise, I'll just have to take you to an orphanage! Mom! Mom! Did you hear what Martin just said? Well, what could he say? How much he loves you? He said that he wants to leave us at an orphanage! Oh, these kids misunderstood everything again. When will you stop blaming everything on my future husband and your new father? He is a wonderful person and I know it. Let's go, Eva. No one cares about us except our dad. I'm so worried. It's hard for me to find contact with them. I also wanted to take them to the orphanage. <laughs> yeah, so they won't stand in the way of our personal life. Actually, I was kidding. Oh, I was kidding too. <laughs> it's so great that we have the same sense of humor. You are my destiny. Yeah, of course. Come on in, bro. Anthony, is this a bad time? You seem upset. It's your birthday today. It's just some stuff with my parents. Don't worry about it. We better play some games. I'll beat you. Easy peasy. <laughs> Even though it's your birthday today. And you get ready for the biggest loser award. Anthony, you hate me more than Eva. Now I'll teach you not to bug me. Yes! <laughs> oh no, how did you score this goal? Years of practice, dude. <laughs> Boys, I brought you cookies. Silly mom. Always shows up at the wrong time. Miss Emma, can I have some tea? You have to pay for it. <laughs> I'll bring it right away. <gasps> Martin? What are you doing here? I'm trying to wipe the floor. Here. What, with scissors? <laughs> what are you laughing at, huh? Martin helps me clean the house. You are so great, honey. <laughs> Mom, get him out of here. I called you my son. And you... Wait, honey. Anthony is so rude. Don't mind him. Honey. Jeez. Now I get why you're not in the mood. Well, I'll win this game anyway. <laughs> yeah, right. You wish. Dear Ava, this is a gift from me. <laughs> Thank you, Mommy. You're the best. I'll hide it in a secret place. Cool! My stash is now $100 more! Okay. Wait! Where is all my money? Oh, Mom! Someone stole all my money! What? Maybe you hid it in another toy or forgot about it. Okay. What else can I steal in here? Oh, you're both here! How about steel shelves? Um, honey, have you seen where Ava put all of her money? She has some money? I didn't know that. It was you! I know it! It was you! You're a liar! I've never stolen anything in my life! That's true! It was your father! Ava, he is a thief and he wants to set up Martin! No! My dad is not a thief! And you dragged this con man into our house! 
I... I raised you! Did everything for you! And that's how you thank me? Don't cry. Don't cry, honey. Please. Ava, I need to talk to you. Let's go. Let go Don't of me! Cry. It was him! <laughs> She's so naive. I'll clean out this house. Here. Uh, Adam? Hello, Eva. Wow, you came. Well, it's my girlfriend's birthday. I couldn't miss this. Here. <gasps> Thank you. And this is for Anthony. Can you give it to him? Uh-huh. Come on in. I'm just gonna go change. It's in the living room. Uh-huh. <sighs> Sitting on the couch, doing nothing. What can be better? Yeah, I'm doing great here. Darn it. Spilled it. Ugh. Oh, a rag. That's what I need. There. As if nothing happened. Whew. Oh, there he is. Couch potato. Hello, darling. Don't darling me. I'm not your daughter. What a nasty girl. Why is there a stain on my dress? <laughs> you little piggy got dirty again. You ruined my dress. Tell me the truth. Eva, stop bugging me. I'm busy doing something important, watching the TV. How could mom fall for you? Your mom has good taste. And I have good taste in money. Actually, it's all your brother's fault. Yep. As usual, I hope you get kicked out of this house. Ha! <laughs> you wish. Oh, it's so great that I have a son-in-law. Mom, stop it, please. Your mom is just kidding. Kidding? No. Mom, give us something to eat. We are hungry. Uh-huh. Here, pasta for my son-in-law. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, enjoy. I'll be right back. Mmm, your mom is such a great cook. My mom is great at ordering deliveries from the restaurants. <laughs> bon appetit. Mm -hmm. I want some too. <gasps> Martin, stop ruining my day. Hey, you little girl. Why are you so greedy? Your dad is hungry too. So this is your dad? No, and he never will be. Adam, we're leaving. Well, go. I'll eat it myself. Anthony, help us. What's wrong? Your dad. Not dad, our stepdad. Sick of him. We have to do something. How do we kick Martin out? I don't know. Why are you so sad? It's your birthday. You look miserable, Anthony. And you, Eva, even worse. Sorry, let's watch a movie. Ugh. You're right. Because of Martin, we watched an action movie, not a comedy. Yes, Eva, it's asking for password. Try the day you first kissed. <laughs> Anthony, cut it out. Wait a second, you have news open here. Wait, scroll up. Here, Eva, look! Is this... our stepfather? Dangerous criminal wanted? Um... Well, I don't want to upset you, but your mom lives with... a con artist. I knew it. We have to follow him. Adam, are you with us? Sure. I won't leave you. Okay. Just a little bit left, and this family will be completely broke. There he is! There he is! Let's go! Stop! Are you following me? Uh, we know you're a criminal. <laughs> yeah, and? We'll tell Mom everything. <laughs> she won't believe you. And even if you do tell her, your Adam is gonna be in trouble. No! 
not Adam. Take Anthony. What? Darn it, Eva. Stupid family. Ugh. Oh, man. Miss Emma won't believe us. Let's kick him out on our own. So, guys, what's our plan? Oh, uh, I feel like we're gonna screw it up again. Don't worry. There are three of us against him. We can do this. Adam, you are so smart. Hey, I'm standing right here. What are you doing? Behave yourselves. I got it. Who will get the towel? No, 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 no. I'll pass. Of course, only I can risk my life in this family. Go already. I leave you alone for a second and you're doing God knows what out here. Well, got the towel? Did he see you? Here, uh, where do you need it? You'll see. Unbelievable, so awesome, great plan. But why are you doing this? <laughs> oh, you're so silly. Go hang the towel back and let's wait a couple of minutes. Dad, thank you. I'm so glad that on our birthday, we got together as a family. I love you so much. Uh, where is your friend? Adam, he went to the bathroom. He'll be right back. Who did this? Who dared to pour paint on Martin? Why? Why don't they like me in this family? <laughs> 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 and they're laughing at me! Whoa, what a nightmare! My dear, honey, he did it, I know it! You? I should have known. Get out of our house! Mom, our dad didn't do it! Enough! You have always protected him. I can't take it anymore. These guys are so bad, they're bullying me! Well, we poured the paint on his towel. No, your daddy did it. Come here. Get out come of on, here. Stop it. Don't do this. Go. No. And no, never, mom. Come, never back. come back. Go. Uh. Go. Let dad back in. No, he will never set foot in this house again. You completely ruined our birthday. Kids. Your mom only wants what's best for you. You see? You have such a great dad. So caring. I also have a surprise for you. My dear Emma. <laughs> will you marry me? What? what? <gasps> uh, what did I miss? While you were in the bathroom, they kicked out my dad. <laughs> I have been waiting for this for so long. I, I, I will. <laughs> Mom, no. Yes, yes, Anthony, yes. Oh. <laughs> what are you doing there? Come on, hurry. Well, is everything ready? Of course it is, here. Oh, wow. So much dough! Did you bring the bag? No. Only empty trash bags. I knew I couldn't trust you with anything. Start packing it. Chop, chop! What's going on here? Who are these rats in my attic? Oh, oh, my love! Get your hands off me. Who is that in the mask? Me? Um, uh, I'm a spider. I live in the attic. Oh, you're such a liar. You lied to me. You are a thief. Ugh, let's run. Ah! <laughs> How could he do it? <laughs> um, don't cry. <laughs> you don't have to comfort me. Nobody needs me. <laughs> uh. No, Mom. We really need you. 
first your dad left me, and now Martin too. Actually, you kicked dad out yourself. And this Martin, he's a criminal. Uh-huh. Leave me alone. Who can it be? <laughs> Good afternoon. <laughs> it's... You're gonna go live with your dad. Uh, Mom? Can you tell us what's going on? This is my new husband. This is for you. <laughs> Thank you. Who? Mom, he's homeless. What are you talking about? Shame on you. Tim is very rich. He promised to buy me an island. Mom, <laughs> come on. Enough. Pack your things and go live with your dad. And you, sir... Come on in. <laughs> Ew. Boy, Mom's fiance stinks. Mm-hmm. I think it's really best for us to go live with Dad. Uh-huh. But I feel like if I told you I was ready right this minute, do you think that it would turn you on?